everyone. Uh, I'm Javi. Hi. Hola. And this is me. I just want to talk about a little bit about myself. I love traveling. It can be on my, how do you call that? Uh, the jet ski or in a flight or whatever way it comes. I love traveling with my friends. These are my friends from Venezuela. Right here, this is me. Uh, um, uh, every year we used to do a couple of travels a year, uh, a year and we always had fun and we always said we just need an excuse to travel. So for my project, for my final project, I just wanted to build a website that we actually could use and have fun with. So yeah, we just need an excuse to travel. So that's why I created Floyd, an app that allows you to search for events uh, and get the flights to go there. Um, at the beginning, I thought about using an API for concerts. An API basically is a, a server that has a lot of information about concerts. Uh, uh, the first day, I applied to three APIs, and I'm still waiting for the response. I'm like John Travolta. Yeah, I'm like, yeah. So that didn't work. I ran out to the RAT, which is the riskiest assumption test. So I had to change the whole concept of my project on the first day, and I found an API for events, basically on art event, and uh, the, I changed the concept to travel with art. Ooh. So <laughs> let me get out of here. How the guy? Okay. So this is the the app. Uh, it has a little animation here, but I don't know if it's working right now. Wait. That. <laughs> So they, basically the user can search for an event, find your flights, this needs a padding, uh, and enjoy the trip. <laughs> and log in, sign up, and explore. So let's log in and try it out. Uh, you have to put a username, so I'm going to put Javi Romero, blah, blah, blah. Uh, password, localization. Yo, chill. Barcelona. So we oh shit. Uh, we take the the localization from the user. So if you don't put a valid password, uh, you have to do this. Blah, blah, blah. So sign up, and you go to the explore page. So where would you guys like to travel to? London. 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 I hear. <laughs> Let's try London. We are in Barcelona, bien. So we search for London, and we receive a list of events that are happening right now in London, like the Great British Beer Festival, of course. Uh, we got the Play Expo. We have a long, 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 long list. Let's just pick one. Welcome, Italy. I love Italy. Uh, 50 Cent, get rich or die trying. 15th anniversary in London. Let's go there. Get the flight. Searching for flights from Barcelona to London. Let's give it a second and we'll be there. Uh, boom. Yeah, there we go. So select your departing flight from Barcelona to London. We get a huge list of possible flights. So you see the departure is the same date as the event that we look for. And you see the duration of the, pri uh, the flight and the price. Obviously, I'm unemployed right now. So the cheapest one. Of course. So we have to select the arriving flight from London to Barcelona, so the flight back, uh, obviously the cheapest one again. And we go to the, the, like the summary page. So here you can see the, the event, the flight out, and the flight back. So if you click on the book event, you go to the page where actually the event is going on, and you can pay for it. So you can pay here 36 pounds if you want. I'm not paying 36 pounds for 50 cent. <laughs> <laughs> And in the flight back, you go to the, this is the API I connected to. So you see uh, the flight we selected. So Barcelona to London, 24 euros with Ryanair. Uh, so that's basically my demo. Let me go back to this. So what I learned that is using two APIs is crazy. Like if you have only one week to, to do a project, please do not do it. If you care about your health, if you care about the TA's health, don't do it. Please. Um, 
I crashed. There was a day that I couldn't get the APIs to work, but there was guys behind me say, trust the process. So I got up, kept on fighting, and uh, at the end, I could deliver the project. Uh, I learned also that I love front-end. CSS can be a bitch sometimes, but I love tweaking and doing animations and stuff. I use the CSS grid, which is nothing, it's not, we learn, it's not something we learned in the, in the boot camp, but I decided to, to go for it and give it a try. Um, what else? If I had to start again, yeah, I would probably test the APIs. Don't be afraid of the APIs, just really dive into them, look for the documentation, search if you can, apply them in your project, and everything's gonna be fine. You have to search, don't do like me, please. And thank you, and shout out to all the peers. Yeah.